shushing the people of Stoke is going to work. Good grief. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mr. Goose, and I am here to represent the standards and practices for ethical wrestling. Mr. Goose, it has been uh, mentioned that the uh, the Office of the uh, Standards and Practices of Ethical Wrestling for Ethical Wrestling Standards and Practices for Ethical Wrestling does have an unfortunate acronym to it that has been mentioned. Um, is there any plans to change the name of the department at all? Of course not. The standards, well, the acronym is SPVW. Uh, if people feel the need to say it all as one word, quite frankly, it's the same people who like to abbreviate a couple's name by putting the two names together. It's just, it's not correct. It's just lazy and it's not efficient. Uh, so speaking of shipping, your opponent tonight is uh, the Road Pirate, uh, the man. Yes, it was meant to be Geordie Stew. It, it was, yes. Uh, unfortunately, um, George Stew is unable to uh, make it tonight. To be fair, it's due to illness, and uh, you should not be attending any wrestling event if you or anybody that you know is suffering from any sort of illness, as you can pass it on to other people there, and more importantly, to the wrestlers, myself, if I get ill because of you, I'll be furious. <laughs> so what we're saying is that people who are spewing should not be attending wrestling events? Yes, people who spew should not attend wrestling events. Now I have a question for everybody here tonight. Quick question. Would anybody steal a handbag? A handbag? No, I wouldn't steal a handbag. No? Would anybody here steal tickets to watch the show? No. So, my final question, why, when a known pirate is coming out to the ring, piracy, guys, is a crime. Oh, when he see. is climbing up onto this top rope, doing unsafe manoeuvres that not only endanger the performers, but everybody at ringside, why do you cheer for a man like Ritmo? What, what, what a load of baloney. Why do you cheer for something it is raw, uncooked fish. No, do not cheer that. Being in Stoke is, is a wonderful thing. The chance of salmon. from a room full of drunkards and idiots. How about you introduce the next room? I mean, I mean, I'm vegetarian, but even I like the silly salmon.